today I wanted to talk to you about something that I was fairly certain I'd filmed a video for but I can't see it on my channel. I might have put it in another video but I don't think I did. What I wanted to talk to you about is being depressed and happy at the same time. That sounds like a complete oxymoron but what I mean is feeling happy when you have depression. I've made no secret about the fact that I've been in a relationship in the last 18 months because I filmed this in February and my life has changed considerably for the better. I've actually written a blog post about how being in a relationship has affected my mental health and what it means to me and how it's changed me. Um, I'll leave that down below so go and read that if you would like please and um, subscribe to my blog as well. I just wanted to talk to you about what it feels like to to be happy with certain aspects of your life, to be happy in a moment but still have depression and still be depressed. I've had depression and anxiety that I can identify since I was a child. I spent my teenage and adult years trying to kill myself. I was on my own. If I wasn't on my own, I was in an abusive relationship. I didn't care about things I wasn't feeling. I was numb, I was in pain. And basically I gave up. When I met Sam, I had given up on people I didn't trust anybody and I didn't have any desire to have anybody in my life because people had fucked me over so much before. I obviously hadn't given up completely on people because Sam came into my life and he made me very happy. I've always identified that there are kind of three elements to to anybody's depression and um, especially to my depression um, and that is chemical, environmental and situational being so chemical being obvious, environmental being the environment you're in and your kind of long-term sort of situation situational is more if an event occurs that can affect your depression um you can have just one of these um have depression or you can have all three obviously i have chemical depression and i guess environmental depression the situational one is probably the one that has changed i am i have somebody in my life now who makes me very happy who I have nice times with, which I've never had before. But that doesn't mean that my depression has gone away. That doesn't mean that sometimes I feel very isolated, very desolate and desperate and sad and depressed. I think my anxiety has also gone up, especially in the last few months, whereas kind of like, as I said, my situational depression has come down. My anxiety has gone up and that has affected me in both mental and mental mental and physical ways. I've never had it affect me physically before um, in the way it has now. I've had a shit time in my life a lot of the time and honestly I don't think anyone in my situation wouldn't have wanted to not be in it, wouldn't have wanted to, wouldn't have given up. Constant pain, I had family problems, I had no friends and I had a mountain of hurt in my past. Life didn't seem worth it to me and honestly I don't think it was, not then, it was nothing. I can't begin to tell you how awful I felt for so many years and the life that I led, especially when I was diagnosed with the osteoarthritis in my hips, I was just in bed all the time and I spent maybe two years, I think two years, literally in bed all day every day trying to kill myself, planning how I can end my life, self-harming and just crying and being miserable. As I said, things are different now. Um, whilst my depression and my mental illnesses are still there, um, I have someone in my life who makes me very happy. Certain things have changed. I think there's this big misconception that people have of people with depression, that they always live under this big black cloud. But that's not true. Obviously, as I've described, I have been under a big black cloud, but People can have fully functioning lives but still have depression. They can appear fine on the outside but they're dying on the inside. People can have depression but have happy moments. It's not all doom and gloom. There is kind of light and shade to everything. In, in life there is light and shade to everything but with depression there is light and shade. And you can have the light and the shade at the same time. A bit like if you were to put like contouring and highlighting on the same area of like your face and both were to shine through. That won't make much sense to anyone really, but I, that's, I don't know what I'm saying. But I don't have anything else to offer on this. I just wanted to talk about this and say, this is going on, this is how I feel. Does anybody else feel like this? Talk about this. Um, 
if you if this is something you, you can identify with then please talk to me down below talk to each other create a discussion because as I have said many times in my videos the more that we talk about things the better people will understand what we're going through the less stigma the less judgment there will be and that's always a good thing and I hope this video will be helpful to somebody even if I don't think it's actually made much sense I will see you again soon please like this video and subscribe if you haven't already and as I said check out my blog and I will see you again soon